everybody and welcome to vlogmas day eight so today i have a couple of things going on it's my day off from work so the first thing i'm going to do this morning is to get a facial i am treating myself um for christmas uh to a facial and i used to get these all the time when i used to work at a medical spa um for a year and a half i used to get free facials which is one of the perks i missed the most um i loved working at that job actually but you know, I was doing front um, front desk work, so it wasn't paying a whole lot of money. But man, my coworkers were awesome, and the benefits were incredible. But anyway, so I'm back at the place where I used to work, <laughs> and they still give me a discount, which is really generous of them. It's a small business, and yeah, so I'm doing that this morning, getting a facial. Um, and what am I doing this afternoon? I'm going to go get lunch and then go home. And then I'm meeting my friend for, uh, we're meeting at a, Me a Mexican restaurant to do like chips and salsa, just like a little afternoon snack. Um, we usually do coffee, but I think I'm kind of burnt out on coffee, especially next week. I'm having two more coffee kind of meetups with friends and I'm like, okay, can we do something different? Um, so we're meeting at a Mexican restaurant to eat, um, chips and guacamole and salsa for a little bit before we have to pick up the kids from school. So yeah, that's my day today. Um, I'm hoping to get some presents organized. Um, I still have to go to the post office sometime soon to get some things mailed out, probably next week. I did not put like any work into my mom's socks yesterday because it was just like, my Wednesdays are just the worst. And next Wednesday I actually have a, our staff party is actually in the eight o'clock in the morning <laughs> before we open. And then I have to work until close at eight o'clock in the morning. So yeah, Wednesdays are just like my worst day. So I'm still recovering from Wednesday. But anyway, so that's what I am planning on doing today. Um, it should be a relaxing, fun-filled day. <laughs> so I will take you along with me and um, yeah, so I'll check in with you later. Hello everybody and it is now afternoon. It is about 1.30 in the afternoon. And unfortunately, my afternoon plans have been canceled because my friend's um, kiddo is sick. So we are not meeting up this week, so that's fine. Um, it lets me catch up on some household chores that I have to get done. have several loads of laundry I want to get done. Um, still putting away my hand-knit socks. <laughs> have a pile here that I got to put away. Um, I just wash my hand-knit socks in the washer and then air dry them and I've never had a problem. Um, I have so many of them that I have to do it that way. I can't hand wash all of them, unfortunately. But so those have been in the washer and now they have, it only takes basically like an evening for them to dry on like the little clothes dryer. It's like a little clampy thing. It's like a circle. <laughs> um, and they're great. So those are done. Um, I want to get some stuff off my desk. This is kind of stressing me out that I have all of the stuff on my desk. I have to finish writing Christmas cards because that's what's taking up most of the room on my desk. Um, so I have to get those done. And yeah, and then I have to go pick up Amelia um, in like two, less than two hours. I also found out that I have to go pick up a card for my boss because we've decided to do a combined group gift for my boss. So that kind of illuminates me trying to guess what he likes and what he doesn't like. Um, so we're just going to get him a gift card to his favorite restaurant and everybody's going to contribute like a, a few bucks here and there. So that should be great. So I'm going to get him a card since it was my idea. I'm going to go get the card and then, um, I think we're going to give it to him at the holiday party on, um, Wednesday. So I want to make sure everybody has time to sign it before we give it to him on Wednesday. Yeah. So I have to go back to Target today. <laughs> Uh, at least going during the week is not as bad as going on weekends for sure. Um, I'm trying to think of what else I have to get done. All my schoolwork is done. Everything has been submitted. Um, I haven't gotten back my final grades, but yeah, I don't see any surprises coming up there. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's been my day. Um, the facial was fantastic. I really enjoyed kind of catching up with one of my former coworkers and I just feel like you know, clean and definitely have to do it, you know, at least once or twice a year because it just feels so much better just to get all of that dead skin off my face and just get like pampered a little bit. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm just like chill, chill. 
I'm, I'm re recharging for tomorrow. I work tomorrow. So I have one more day of work this week. And then um, we have some activities planned this weekend, some holiday activities. Tomorrow, we're going to go see some lights. And then on Saturday, we're going to go to like a holiday market. So that should be fun. And then Wednesday, or Sunday, don't even know what day of the week it is anymore. Uh, Sunday, we're just going to stay home and watch movies and do nothing. Basically, that's like the hope for my day on Sunday because I need one of those days <laughs> of not leaving the house, not doing anything, not getting out of my pajamas. Yeah, so that's what you have to look forward to. <laughs> All right, so I will, um, if I don't talk to you again, um, I hope you have a great day and I will see you tomorrow. Hello everybody, I didn't think I was gonna hop on here again, but here I am. Uh, I went to Walmart and I bought a couple of things and I wanted to show you my, my little haul. So this happened because um, I'm usually not a Walmart shopper because it's just not very convenient for me. Um, Target is much more convenient and I just like their stuff better than Walmart, just personally. Um, and it's much easier to get in and out of Target shopping center than it is the Walmart shopping center. And the Walmart shopping center is like on the other side of town. And yeah, so the story the, there is that I, uh, I rarely go to Walmart unless I need something very specific that they carry there. And I was washing, um, I was reorganizing my socks. I was putting them back actually from being washed and I noticed that I was running out of room. <laughs> so let me show you my current sock situation. Um, and these are just my everyday socks because for Christmas, well, let me show you Christmas first. So for Christmas, I, ha I bought this box this year and basically this is gonna be, they're not, uh, I don't have enough of them to actually stack them, but this is gonna be my Christmas box wait, wait, Christmas <laughs> box of socks. And I'm just gonna put this like away every year and keep them separately and I have the same thing for Halloween. But my everyday socks, are you ready for this? <laughs> so this is my everyday sock bin. So I have this and this is like, like two or three layers full. And then I have, I started this one. So obviously, I had a little bit of a problem <laughs> because they were not fitting there and they're not going to fit here when I put them all in. And it just so happens that at the same time I was doing all of this organization, I was watching the crazy, um, crazy sock lady, Kay, and she was talking about her sock organization and how she keeps her socks. And she was mentioning that um, she uses like ornament boxes um, to keep her socks in. And I thought, oh yeah. Um, and I've seen her show these off um, year after year and it just never occurred to me to go buy some at the store but these are ornament boxes at Walmart and they're $9.98 each but basically what I like about this is that they already have I mean you can use these if you want I'm not going to use these dividers but they already have like rows that they'll just perfectly sit in and I bought two of them I think two should be more than enough and um yeah so these are gonna go under my bed or in my closet, I'm not sure, but it's just a nice little convenient way to store socks. And it's much like the fact that it's clear, I also like because I could see the socks through the top, which I can't do with obviously this one. Um, so I was really excited about that. And then of course I had to stop by the fragrance aisle. I like to look at the candles and smell everything, <laughs> see if there's anything new. I was specifically looking for like a rose scented wax just so I could mix it with other waxes. And I haven't been able to find one that's just like a really like inexpensive one that I could just mix with other things. But I did impulse buy this. <laughs> so this is a wax burner and it has Himalayan salt. I've been wanting something with Himalayan salt. I don't know why. It just like appeals to me like that whole vibe. <laughs> Um, so this one has like Himalayan salt around it and then there's a like a little light in the middle and then um, the wax melts around the top and I just thought it was like I like I like where this is going <laughs> so we'll see I have to put it together because you see here the obviously the the rocks are up here and all of that stuff so yeah that should be interesting and then I got some new smells new wax melts <laughs> so I bought some like these were like a dollar each. Um, this is fresh cotton. And I just got this to, um, and it smells like just like laundry. Um, it says cold, cool ozone, fresh laundry and driftwood. So it just smells like fresh and clean. And there's a lot, I've been trying to find like the perfect like ocean scent and I haven't been able to find it yet. Um, but 
I can't even describe it. I would just be able to smell it because <laughs> some of them are just too cologne-y or like, you know, they just don't have the right notes. So I figured that to be able to use those up, I'll be able to mix it in with the fresh cotton and just kind of have like a clean smell. And then I got rosemary and spearmint. So this one's really nice. This is just like a little herbal smell. Like you can really smell the, the spearmints in there. And then uh, bergamot and bergamot and sage. So again, another like herb, herbally smell as well. Um, this smells really good. Yeah, I'm kind of into like the fresh smells lately. So I got those. Um, these two were in clearance, and that one, these two were a dollar each. So that was nice. Um, might be able to use those. Um, kind of when I go through all of my Christmas ones. But yeah. Um, so I've been enjoying the day, just taking it easy. I have to work tomorrow. Um, and yeah, I have been putting together the gifts for my coworkers. I decided to get like at least my my team, everybody something on my team is what I decided on that. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm not looking forward to taking these presents to work with me because it's like attention. It's like people like see you and the attention that comes with it and they wonder like who the presents are for so i'm not looking forward to that aspect of it <laughs> but yeah anyway um i'm gonna like reorganize these and i will see you i think after this i'll definitely see you tomorrow <laughs> bye